Good evening, everybody. Good evening, teacher. Good evening, teacher. Welcome. Teacher, to the class. sorry. Okay. Teacher. Yes, Jacqueline. Today I will be again a listening. Oh, ah, okay. Class I understand. I'm working. You're working right now. Thanks. Okay, yes. I understand. Thanks. I understand, no problem. Give me a second. I will. I will take notes. Okay. Thank you, thank you, and welcome. Welcome, everybody. So, to begin, we're going to show you, a, I'm going to show you a, a PowerPoint presentation. Okay. Eh, Programa Nacional de Inglés para el Trabajo. English National uh, or Work, right? And uh, the name of the module is Module 3. And the, the topic is Industry Vocabulary. Vocabulary, sorry. Industry Vocabulary. Mm -hmm. And today we are in February. The first day of February, right? Okay. Hello, Adelia. Welcome. Alicia. Hello, Adelia. It's a pleasure. Hello. Hello. Welcome. Welcome, Alicia. Welcome, Daniel. Mirna. Welcome. Uh, Claritza, yes? Yeah, teacher. Ah, okay. Welcome. <laughs> Welcome to the class. Yes. Thank okay, you. good. You're welcome. Now, so let's start with the objective, right? This is unit number two. The name of the unit two is socializing. Socializing. Okay. Good evening. I hear I read your message, Clarissa, in the in the chat. Thank you. Welcome to the class again. Yes. Okay. And what is the objective? What is the objective for this class? Uh, let me see. Daniel, please, can you read the objective for the class of tonight, please? Okay, teacher. Good evening. Good evening. I will be able to send you information about the companies. Expertise, I teacher. <clears throat> expertise, expertise, industrial. This is a classified. Come as classify, 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 and where a ah, classification. Uh -huh, yes, <laughs> and where <laughs> it operates. <laughs> okay, no problem. <laughs> easy, easy. I mean, no problem. I understand. Don't worry. So, in this case, what is the 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 objective of your company, what do, what do you do, right? Rosibel, welcome, welcome to the class. Okay, uh, okay. the industrial classification, if it is uh, related with uh, clothes, if it is related with uh, tourism, uh, transportation, etc., cetera, etc., cetera, right? The classification. And also where your company operates in El Salvador, in Panama, in Guatemala, in Mexico, in the United States, et cetera, et cetera, right? Oh, in San Salvador, Santa Ana, San Miguel, et cetera. Here, for example, in, in the group, we have uh, many students from Santa Ana, right? So, um, for example, one example of the company that works in, in Santa Ana is Imacasa, right? The company of Rossi. Uh -huh. So uh, this is uh, the place where Imacasa operates in Santa Ana, right? 
and other companies over here. We're going to talk about your companies, eh, tu Misión Bautista, Crédito y Negocios, eh, Hotel, Hotel Citlali, <laughs> Citlali. I imagine this is Nahuatl, right? Creo que este nombre es Nahuatl, ¿verdad? Citlali, me suena, suena bonito ahí, ok. Banco Cuscatlán, Banco Atlántida, Padre Arrupe, etcétera, etcétera. We're going to talk about all the companies. The branches, you know, uh, sucursales, right? And other information about your company. Okay, so to begin, we're going to learn about some information of the company. For example, what is headquarters? Headquarters where a company or organization has its main offices, its principal offices, right? Uh, let's say, for example, uh, uh, Kimberly Clark, for example, right? Kimberly Clark has the headquarters in Sitio del Niño. In Opico, right? Sito del Niño is the headquarter for Kimberly Clark, El Salvador. Welcome, Maribel. Welcome to the class. Okay, so uh, this is the headquarters. Embotelladora Salvadoreña. Hmm. They have the headquarter in San Salvador, I guess. Yes. Mm -hmm. Okay, now branch is a shop or office representing a large company or organization in a particular area. Uh, one of the most common is uh, the banks, for example, right? Uh, let's talk about, for example, Banco Cuscatlán. Uh, Carlos Vega works in, in Banco Cuscatlán. And you tell me, but I, I believe that the headquarters of Banco Cuscatlán is in uh, La Pirámide, right? La Pirámide in Santa Tecla. Uh-huh, and the headquarters. But they have branches in, let me see, Banco Cuscatlán, uh, uh, San Luis, Banco Cuscatlán, San Luis, La Fuente, Banco, well, there are many Banco Cuscatlán, right? Atlantida too, right? Banco Atlantida. They have many branches. Mm -hmm. So they are shop or offices representing the company, right? And let's talk about restaurant, for example, right? Um, restaurant, uh, the problem is, I don't know where is the headquarters. The headquarters of uh, Burger King, Burger King, for example, right? The headquarter of Burger King is in, uh, I, Believe the, the, the company's name is Nicomi S.A. Nicomi is in uh, Centro Industrial San Jorge, San Salvador, right? Uh, it's close in Juan Pablo II. Final de la, de la Juan Pablo II. So it's, that is the headquarters. And uh, Burger King, they have branches in Metro Centro. And, and they have branches. Well, a lot of places, right? Burger King is... <laughs> Everywhere you want hamburgers, Econocombo, right? Please, Econocombo. <laughs> Wherever you go, you can get an Econocombo, okay? So this is the, the difference between headquarters, that is the principal office, and branches that are small offices or shops representing the, the, the principal organization or company, right? Okay, let's, let's say uh, uh, we're going to practice pronunciation, right? And then you're going, I'm going to ask some students to repeat individually. So come on, repeat after me, please. Repeat after me. Headquarters. The place where a company they were, they played. The pl sorry, sorry, excuse me. Alguien me hizo una pregunta, sorry. Es que desconecté los micrófonos en ese momento, pero alguien me estaba preguntando, Clarixa, ¿no? ¿Clarixa? No, no teacher, no, estoy no, pronunciando. Okay. Ah, ok, muy bien. Ok, sí. sorry, sorry, me confundí. Pero apaguemos los micrófonos un ratito, ¿sí? Ok, thank you, thank you. Now, the place where a company or organization 
has its main offices. Has its main offices. Eh, se preguntarán por qué usamos el posesivo acá, de possessing. It's. Because you say it's is used for animal, for example, right? But in this, uh, for example, remember the, the, the possessive, my, your, his, hers, your, etc., cetera, etc. Cetera. But in this case, uh, it refers to the company, right? Cuando nos referimos de uh, cosas que le pertenecen a su oficina o a su compañía, usamos el it's, el possessivo para cosas y animales, okay? Continue, repeat after me, please. Branch. A shop or office, a shop or office representing a large company, representing a large company or organization in a particular, sorry, in a particular area. in a particular area. Okay? Now, I will take the attendance. Vamos a tomar la asistencia y luego vamos a pedir su colaboración para que me ayuden a leer. Eh, Adelia? Present. Thank you. Welcome. Brian? Present, teacher. Thank you, Brian. Welcome to the class. Carlos Vega? Present. Oh, Carlos. Good. Sorry. Perdón por interrumpir la clase. Eh, Carlos, ¿cómo ha estado? ¿Todo bien? Todo bien, teacher. Ah, vaya, sí. Mucho trabajo, ¿verdad? Sí, la, la disculpa del caso, pero... No no, no, no hay problema. Yo entiendo. Ya me han mandado algunos mensajes por ahí también. Yo entiendo que hay mucho trabajo. Eh, pero siempre que pueda y, y quiera estar bien, avisa para yo tomarle la asistencia. Oiga. Gracias, teacher. Pero hoy sí va a participar. Sí, sí, sí. Hoy sí. Excelentoso. Yeah. Thank you. Uh -huh, yes. Yes, Maribel. Perdón, ayer sí me dio, oh, no sé si la vez pasada le comenté que padecía de migraña mm, y sí, sí, ahí sí, he sí. tenido un mes bien difícil, diciembre, enero es bien difícil para mí. Entonces, ayer tuve un colapso y créame oh. que no me quería desconectar, pero me inyectaron y perdí la noción del tiempo. Cuando vine a ver, ya era bien noche, ya no me podía conectar. No, no hay problema, Maribel. Su salud es lo primero, no se preocupe, ¿verdad? Sí, este, discúlpeme. ¿Y ahorita cómo se siente? ¿Ahorita cómo se siente, Maribel? Fíjese que todavía me siento un poquito, me siento un poquito así con dolor, pero eh, no se me salió de las manos porque como a las dos de la tarde pude contestar igual el teléfono, he estado bien ocupada, o sea, aunque yo me enferme, tengo que llegar a trabajar y lo primero es, tremendo, es ponerme sí. al día de lo que me quedó pendiente. Lo siento, entonces ni modo, el fin de semana le va a tocar que ponerse al día con la plataforma y todo, ¿verdad? Sí, así sí, es. No te preocupes. Eh, eh, a veces me quedo bien noche también estudiando, entonces yo sentí que me, está, me porque... he estado como eh, demasiado, esforzando demasiado, pero igual vale la pena. Va, así esto que va dije... para... No hay problema, Maribel, esto va para todo. Yo sé que están haciendo un gran esfuerzo con este curso, o sea, ya terminando allá bien noche. Inclusive, pues, con los que me quedo los 10 minutos extra, yo sé que es un esfuerzo, ¿verdad? Mucho trabajo en el día y luego venir en la noche. Es un... Hay que poner mucho esfuerzo. Entonces, desde ya lo felicito a todos. A todos lo felicito por este gran esfuerzo que están haciendo. Pero créanme que les va a traer muchas recompensas el que hagan este esfuerzo. Y si se sienten mal, pues, díganme, ahí está el chat. O mándenme a mi número, no hay problema. Yo, yo entiendo, ¿verdad? Que no va a ser de todos los días, ¿verdad? Espero que, que no se sientan tan presionados, ¿verdad? Um, eh, espero también que ya febrero, pues, baje un poquito el... Eh, especialmente los, los, las compañías que se dedican a la venta y todo eso, yo entiendo que hay mucha presión. Así que espero que, que siga mejor, Maribel, y pues, que todos estemos bien. Cuídense mucho, tomen muchita, muchísima Gracias, agua, señor. muchísima Perdón. agua, líquidos, líquidos y todo, sí, sí. No hay problema. Ok, let's continue. Eh, Clarissa. Eh, presente, teacher. Ok, present, eh, Clarissa. Present. Presente, teacher, que estoy un poco enferma. 
Ay, yo estoy ¿cómo? enferma de la gripe. Oh, sorry, sí. Clarissa. Sí, se oye un poquito, ¿verdad? pero sí. esa es un, una, gran, mala. una gran pichelada de, de, de fresco de naranja ahí para que le, le ayude. Digo nada. Ah, sí. Para que se me vaya aquí. Ok, cool. Así es, primero Creo Dios que, que así se... Que se mejore. Bueno. Ok. Sí. Eh, ok. ¿Qué? Kevin, ¿tenía algo que decirme, Kevin? Good evening, teacher. Este, bien, estaré bien. bien. Ah, Voy vaya, manejando. Eh. Va, está bien, cuando llegue a casita me avisa para a saber si va a participar, oiga. Ok, eh, good, good. Dani. Present teacher. Thank you. Maribel. Present teacher. Thank you. Elmer. Present teacher. Ok, welcome Elmer, todo bien. Que ayer no pudo conectarse, ¿verdad? Yes. Eh... Oh. Estaba en el cierre en la empresa. Ah, ya me imagino. Estaba un poco atrasado ahí con el trabajo. Ya me imagino. No, no me preocupe, tranquilo. O él, ¿me va a decir algo, Joel? Joel. Good evening. Good evening. Good evening. Teacher. Eh, eh, que sorry, estaba, estaba en la, venía de, en camino, no sé si pasó okay. lista. No, ahorita estoy ya. pasando lista. Ahorita le, ya le tomé la asistencia a usted. Tranquilo. Ok, Erika. Present teacher. Thank you, Guillermo. Present teacher. Welcome, Guillermo. Iván. Present teacher. Thank you. Welcome to the class. Eh, Carlos Amaya. Mr. Amaya. Here. Okay, thank you. Eh, Carla. Carla Beatriz. Okay, and uh, Giovanni, Gio, hello Gio, uh, okay, ya recibí su mensaje Claritza, verdad, pichelazo de limonada, verdad, <laughs> okay, uh, Alice, <laughs> yes, Alicia, Miss Ortez Pineda, Present, okay. perdón que tengo algo malo el Ah, ok, no hay problema. Vamos a estar pendientes. Si se desconecta, pues ya voy a saber qué, pero espero que se le estabilice. Eh, Mirna. Hello, Mirna. Miss Jiménez Moreno. Mirna, el chat, eh, teacher. Está en el chat. Vamos a ver qué nos dice Mirna. Uh, present. Ah, de oyente. Ok. Thank you. Thank you. Good. En Estela. Estela. Ok. Rosy. Present teacher. Thank you. Thank you. Good. Now, let me see. Uh, let's start with. Uh, Adelia, please. Adelia, can you read the, the concept of headquarters, please? Okay. Uh, headquarters, the place where a company or organization has its main offices. 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 Uh -huh. Thank you. Thank you very much. Uh, any question for uh, the meaning or the pronunciation class? Question? No, okay, very good. Regálame un segundito que tengo un mensaje en el grupo. Uh, yes, Carla, Carla está contestando acá. Thank you. Regálame un segundito, solo voy a con... <coughs> poner acá pendiente, ¿verdad? Okay, good. Thank you. Now, let's go to the branch. Uh, branch in Spanish is rama, right? Imagine you, you see a tree. The tree has many branches, right? So uh, the company is like, like a tree and the branches are, you know, like la rama del árbol, no? In this case, uh, we're talking about a, a company, right? Okay, let me see. Help me with the reading, Brian, please. Branch. Branch. Yes, branch. Representing a large company or organized organi organization. Organization in a 
particular area. Okay, thank you very much. Questions for this concept? No question. Okay, good. Cool. Let's continue, right? Let's continue. Uh, I have a question. Yes, yes, Brian. Uh, and we say in a particular lab, porque no se pronuncia diferente. A particular area. Uh -huh. uh, this, this, ah, okay. Uh -huh. uh, well, I will tell you the use of a and, right? Right. Vamos a explicar el uso del a y el and. Somebody say a cat and apple. You know that when you use a, is because the, the word begins with a consonant, right? A consonant, right? Good. And we use an when the word begins with a, a vowel, right? Cuando la palabra comienza con una consonante, pues, usamos a. Y cuando comienza con una vocal, an. Okay? Uh -huh. In this case, for example, when I say a good apple, Ok, usted me puede decir piche, pero que no dijo que Apple es con and. Ok, no en este caso, porque antes del Apple usamos un adjetivo que usa una consonante. ¿Sí? Entonces decimos a good Apple. Uh, pero si dijéramos an interesting, interesting Apple, por ejemplo, right? <laughs> Or an interesting cat, for example, right? For example, we say, why do we use an? Okay, esto es porque el adjetivo empieza con una vocal, mire. ¿Sí? Entonces, aunque el nombre comience con consonante, lo que nos va a mandar aquí es el adjetivo. Ahora vámonos a, a, a la pregunta que usted me hizo. A particular, particular area, area. The pronunciation, right? ¿Por qué ponemos a? Si la palabra area lleva una vocal. A es porque antes lleva un adjetivo, particular. Y ese adjetivo empieza con una consonante. Por eso es que hemos puesto aquí la a en lugar de la an, ¿verdad? No sé si esa era su pregunta, Brian, o yo me fui por otro lado. <ríe> Muchas Esa gracias. es la pregunta, ok, good. Sí, eh, entonces, uh, en resumen, cuando hay adjetivos, pues vamos a seguir la, la, la regla del adjetivo, ¿verdad? Aunque el nombre tenga vocal o consonante, ok. Good, let's continue. Any other question? Ya ven, me agrada mucho que me hagan preguntas. Gracias, Brian. Vamos a ver, ahí le da la, la pauta a los demás compañeros para que me pregunten. Pregúntale, pregúntale. No? Okay. Now let's continue, right? Here we're talking about uh, more information about companies, right? Uh, we have the different industries, the different industries we have about the company, right? For example, uh, the clothes. The clothes is uh, the textile industry. Yes, for example, all the maquilas, right? Uh, um, for example, what maquillas do I don't remember any the cotex, uh, uh, fruit of the loom, la sal, text to fill. Okay, y la sal, y la sal, right? Text to fill or text to fill, yes, very good. It's in uh, Carretera Panamericana next to. Cerca del debido a, a, a Pulo, creo que está texto Well, anyway, the textile industry, right? Good. Hair salon services, the beauty and personal care industry. For example, in this class, we have Corpovelo, right? Mm -hmm. Corpovelo, y who works in Corpovelo? Permítame, aquí tengo los datos. Eh... Ah, ya, ya, se, ya me perdió. Eh, creo que Giovanni, no, no, ¿verdad, Giovanni? 
Bueno, yo me te, tenía entendido que alguien trabajaba en Corpovelo, pero muy bien, ese es The Beauty and Personal Care Industry, right? Car Companies is the out, automotive, automotive, auto, auto, automotive industry, right? Also the medicine, uh, Farmacia San Nicolás, for example, right? Laboratorios, eh, Laboratorio Juan López, Laboratorios, etc., right? The pharmaceutical industry. Mobile, mobile phones, mobile phones, uh, the telecommunication industry, for example, Claro, Tigo, uh, Intel phone, of course, the best, excuse me, the best, Intel phone, right? Okay, uh, the telecommunication industry. Buildings, the construction industry, for example, Siman, um, oh, sorry, uh, se me ha ido los nombres de las compañías, pero okay. Cardboard boxes, the packaging industry, right? Eh, cartones del Salvador, yes. Okay, guided tours, the tourism industry, right? Eh, travel, travel agency, right? Travel, eh, escamilla, agencia de viajes escamilla, for example, right? Uh, is related with the tourism. The hotels, Hotel Citlali, for example, is related with industry, right? Uh, the tourism industry. Uh-huh. Okay, and um, soft drinks, the beverage industry, Botellada uh, Salvadoreña, right? La uh, Cascada. It's, those are examples of soft industry. And banks, right? Créditos y negocios. Uh, es un banco, Adelia, o es una financiera? Finan Perdón, mi no, sí. mi no, financiera, es ¿Es como asociada a Fede Crédito o algo así? Perdón por mi ignorancia. No, es no, no. individual. Uh -huh. Ok, good. Eh, Banco Atlántida, por ejemplo. Banco Catlán, of course, right? That's it, right? Eh, de la, la agencia que más me gusta del Banco Catlán es la de la pirámide, sí, sí. Um, hay una alrededor de la de esta oficina ¿verdad? el Banco Coatlán, me recuerdo que hay unos, una fruta que se llaman caimitos <ríe> um, porque yo trabajaba cerca de, de por ahí ¿verdad? pasaba ahí todos los días viendo los caimitos ahí en la, en la agencia del Banco Coatlán, right? The finance industry, right? Um, ok, good now please repeat after me repeat after me, close the textile industry. Hair salon services. The beauty and personal care industry. The beauty and personal care industry. Car components. The automotive industry. Automotive industry. Medicine. The pharmaceutical industry. Mobile phones. The telecommunication industry. The tel telecommunication industry. Buildings. The construction industry. The construction industry. Cardboard boxes. Cardboard is carton, right? Caja de carton. No? Cardboard boxes. The packaging industry. Packaging. The packaging industry.
guided tours. Guided tours. The tourism industry. The tourism industry. Soft drinks. Soft drinks. Dice eh, la soda, ¿no? Soft drinks. Cuando decimos gaseosa, nos referimos a soft drinks. Ok, the beverage industry. The beverage industry. Beverage. Banks. The finance industry. Finance. The finance industry. Okay, any question? Uh, yes, yes. Como se dice, el car component, la automotive. Or automotive. Or automotive industry. Or auto. Puede decir también, Brian. También puede decir automotive. Así como se oye, automotive. O oro. Automotive. Mm -hmm. Le voy a explicar aquí no, la pronunciación. Pues, buenas preguntas. Me está haciendo, este, ¿cómo se llama? Brian, lo felicito. Vale, mire, por ejemplo, cuando digo water. Permítame un segundo. Me está fallando la internet. Ya, ya pasó. Ok. Water, water. Eh, elevator. Elevator. Entonces, cuando digo oro, puede decir auto, auto o oro. O sea, que la T se puede pronunciar como una R, más o menos. Viene siendo como una R, mire. Ok. Y podemos decir water, water. Elevator, elevator. Oro, auto. O oro. Right? So we say the automotive industry or the automotive industry. Automotive. Automotive. Or automotive, right? Understand, Brian? Okay. Okay, very good. Now, eh, esta pronunciación, mobile, es mobile. Yo le dije mobile, pero... Mm, eh, es más aceptada la pronunciación mobile, mobile phones, mobile phones, ¿sí? Mobile phones, good. I don't know, you, ah, y hay una pregunta, vamos a ver, eh, ah, Guillermo, la de oyente, muy bien, Guillermo, thank you, por reportarse. Oyente, ok. Good. Any other question? No questions? Now, please. I need you to help me reading, please. Uh, Carlos, Carlos Vega, please. Can you read two concepts or two examples of industry, clothes, and hair salon services? Please, Carlos. Read or, or explain? Read. No, no, okay. read, okay. read. Okay. Uh, mobile phones? No, the uh, first one, the first one. Clothes, ah, okay. Okay. clothes uh, the textile industry. Hair salon service, uh, the beauty services, services. personal care industry. Thank you. But in plural, it's services. Services. Okay, thank you, Carlos. Good. Okay. Uh, now, uh, Clarissa, can you help me with two car components in medicine, please? Clarissa, can you hear me? No, okay. So uh, let me see. Mm, Daniel, please read. Read for the class. Okay. Medicine. The pharmaceutical industry, mobile phones, 
the telecommunication industry. Buildings, buildings, ever a teacher. Uh -huh. Yes, yes, buildings. Ah, buildings. sorry, no, es que aquí me falta una L, cierto. <laughs> Siempre me como una letra, sorry. Aquí va una L, buildings. Buildings. Uh -huh. uh, construction industry. Okay, thank you, thank you. Until there, right? Está ahí. Vamos a ver si me ayuda alguien más. Thank you, Dani. Eh, please, Maribel. Ah, no. Si sí, sí va a participar, ¿verdad, Maribel? Hello, Tim. Yes. Uh -huh. Okay. Please read. Cardboard boxes. Cardboard boxes. The packaging industry. Continue. ¿Sí? Guider tours. Guided. The guided. 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 Uh, did. Guided tours. The tourist industry. Okay, the so tourism industry. Continue, continue. Soft, soft drinks. The beverage. 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 Beverage, 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 industry, industry, ¿Así? industry, industry, ah, that's it, back, back, bank, the financing, bank, bank, bank. Mm. bank. the financing industry, finance, finance, Maribel, ¿Tú? finance, yeah. Binance, no, fa, industry. Fa, 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 finance, finance. Binance. No, with F, Maribel. Binance. With F, F. Finance, finance. Binance? No, no, no. Ba, ba, no, it's fa, fa. Like in, like Finance. In. Finance? Finance, correct. Finance okay. industry. That's good, right? Yes, okay. Excellent also. Thank you very much, everybody. Thank you very much. And uh, tonight, again, Doodle is my assistant, so he's giving claps to you, right? Okay, thank you. Thank you very much. Now, we're going to continue with the next part. Good. Here we have some examples of uh, what uh, the industries do, right? For example, Banco Atlantida. At Banco Atlantida, we give credits. So what is the expertise? Give. And we use a verb to describe what Banco Atlantida makes, right? Give credits. We are in the finance industry, right? Banco Atlantida is in the finance Piyuyo, <laughs> VFT, right? And Hotel Sitlali. I don't know the pronunciation, sorry. Sitlali, right? Sitlali. <laughs> At Hotel Sitlali, we rent rooms. We are in the tourism industry. Intel phone. Si me equivocaron algún dato, me dicen, ¿verdad? Porque yo. Más o menos lo que investigué de las compañías. At Intel Phone, we provide telecommunication service. We are in the telecommunications industry. Okay, Corpo Velo. At Corpo Velo, we distribute beauty products. No sé si me he equivocado, me dicen, ¿verdad? Pero sí entiendo lo que distribuye el producto de ellos. We are in the beauty in personal care industry. Okay? Now, repeat after me, please. At Banco Atlantida, we give credits. We are in the finance industry. At Hotel Citlali, we rent rooms. We are in the tourism industry.
we are in the tourism industry. At Intelphone, we provide telecommunication service. Telecommunication service. We are in the telecommunications industry. We are in the telecommunications industry. At Corpo Velo, we distribute beauty products. We distribute beauty products. We are in the beauty and personal care industry. We are in the beauty and personal care industry. Hello, Carla. Tell me, please. Carla, Carlita. Hello. Hello, welcome. Okay. How are you? ¿Todo bien? Sí. <laughs> bien. Okay. Okay. Sí, sí. ¿Va a estar de, de oyente o, o va a estar participando con nosotros, Carla? Voy a estar participando, pero tengo bulla de mi vecino bien fuerte. Ok, no hay problema. Ok. okay. No se preocupe, lo importante es que participe. Yes. Ok, con, gracias. Con todo lo que no le estén poniendo reggaetón es suficiente. Hoy. Okay. Gracias. Ok, welcome. Good class. Now, these are the way we uh, express what is the, the work or what do you do in your, in your company, right? And also the kind of industry uh, your company is. Maybe um, there are some companies that are not in this rubric, right? Uh, your company may be in other, in other category, could be, I'm not sure. Remember, I can speak English, but I'm not expert in companies. <laughs> you are the expert. You are the good one. The teacher only speaks English, right? But you can explain me. Good. Now, uh, we are going to, to give some other examples, right, of your companies. And for that reason, I need you You help me, right? You help me and tell me example of your company. Uh, let's start with um, Maribel, please. Maribel, can you explain the, uh, to the class what care system? Ah, care um, system is Corpovelo, right, uh, Maribel? Yes. Oh, good. Excellent. Ah, pues, yeah. entonces, lo tenemos aquí. <laughs> no sé si estoy en lo correcto, Maribel. Sí, solo que es una clínica de, con nutricionista. Ajá. O sea, que se lleva eh, como, digamos, si una persona llega por primera vez, se hace un expediente. Ok. Se lleva un It's conteo. You, you de, make a file. Uh, de, se le hace un historial clínico. Okay. Cuáles son sus antecedentes, si tienen enfermedades comunes. Eh, por ejemplo, presionar. Mm, presión alta, diabetes, okay. eh, otras enfermedades, puede ser tópicas también. Okay. Es como o se pasa con un nutricionista, se le hace un balance de lo que tiene que perder y de ahí se le pone, eh, digamos, los tratamientos a base de lo que puede usar, porque no se le puede dar cualquier cosa. Es peligroso cuando una persona, por ejemplo, con diabetes se pone a bajar de peso alocadamente, puede bajar, eh, digamos, tener problemas de salud más, a, igual una persona que ha tenido enfermedades graves, por ejemplo, eh, cáncer. Diabetes, Entonces, cáncer. Tiene que, yeah. ajá, tiene, eh, cuando uno llega con un nutricionista, piensa de que es lo que el nutricionista quiere que uno baje. No, tiene okay, que ser so, sorry for the lo que amerita. 
In this case, it's not beauty, it's a health, health product, right? It's like a medicine, uh, vitamins, or, or food that is more recommendable. Mm -hmm. uh -huh. So in this case, exactly. you, you give um, healthy treatments, ¿sí? tratamiento de uh -huh. salud, tratamiento de salud, right? De salud. Health, health sí. treatments. Ok, entonces podemos cambiarle acá un poquito, Maribel. Mire, si estoy en lo, en lo correcto, a Corpovelo, we give health um, treatments. Tratamiento de salud, right? Mm -hmm. ¿Es ok, Maribel? Sí. Yeah, ok, good. Así es. Entonces, ¿en qué industria lo pondríamos? Vamos a ver. Aquí tenemos algunos ejemplos. Sería siempre en beauty, sí, ¿verdad? Porque es personal care. Siempre sería. Es que, uh -huh. Lo que pasa es que es una decisión, es, o sea, es una decisión propia, no es una obligación. Como podría ser, digamos, es la diferencia de una enfermedad única a algo que usted decide o seguir con ese tipo de peso, la silueta a otras enfermedades que usted por obligación, cuando usted es el médico, obligadamente tiene que hacer eso. En ah, cambio, I eso understand. Es It's an option. I understand. Yes. So if you want to Ajá. look your body beautiful, <laughs> you can uh, accept one, one treatment or other es treatment. Es la right? aceptación. Ajá. Es como uno se quiere, digamos. Como uno quiere estar. In nice. my case, uh, Maribel, I, uh, I have a belly, pancita, right? I am ugly, but I am happy. So I am, <laughs> maybe I can accept mm -hmm. a, 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 maybe a treatment to be uh, stronger, right? <laughs> In Corpo Velo, I understand. Sí, tenemos, exacto. Tenemos incluso personas que se han hecho cirugía plástica y oh. esos son cuidados especiales. <laughs> es como un, un plus de lo estético con el, el gimnasio también. Ah, excuse me. So, health and beauty, right? La salud y la belleza unidos. In just y la one belleza company. integral. Corpo mm -hmm. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, you know, mm -hmm. you can call Maribel after the class <laughs> if you're interested. <laughs> okay, nice. Sí. Thank you, Maribel. Now, let me see. Anybody else? Uh, after Maribel, we have Elmer. Intel phone, right? Well, we have one example here. Uh, Elmer, are, are we right? Estamos en lo correcto aquí, Elmer? Telecommunication service or, or, or do you have other, other services or products in Intel phone, Elmer? Yes, teacher, it's correct. It's correct, okay, good. Telecommunication yes, service, okay. The best in El Salvador, right? Okay, thank you, Elmer. Now, Erika, please. Inversiones Italia, right? Can yes, you tell us sure. something about Inversiones Italia, eh, Erika? Okay. Uh, Inversiones Italia is a hotel, beach hotel. Oh, excuse in... me. <laughs> yes. Serious. For real? It's, yes, it's in La Paz. Playa de las Flores, La Paz. It's in San, we... San Juan Talpa, Erika. Yes. San Juan Talpa. Yes. Oh. It's behind it's... to April. Okay, interesting. Um, we rent room to the tourism. So, we are so it's, a res, it's a a a, a resort. A re, resort, right? Hotel. Yes. So you you is a, a hotel, but it has a swimming pools. It has the the ocean. Yes. Has, the ocean restaurant. Mm -hmm. It's pool. similar to the Cameron, but but better, right? Mejor, igual que the Cameron, pero mejor. Yes. Sí. <laughs> yes. Okay. Sí. So in this case, mm, it's in the tourism industry. Tourism industry. <laughs> Sorry, excuse me, excuse me. Okay, so um, in this case, um, care care system is is really no 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 no. Excuse me, ya me perdí. No inversiones Italia. Excuse me, it's. <laughs> is related with the tourism. Thank you, thank you very much. We'll go to, well, Guillermo is in Intel phone too, right? 
Uh, Ivan, please. Hi, uh, teacher. Uh, can you tell me a little, Ivan, about uh, Miran's? Miran's? Miran's is the name, the name of the company, right? Miran S.A. Okay. Mm -hmm. okay. Conocido como Boca Olas. Boca Olas. Sí, okay. está ubicado en la playa El Tunco. Ah, es Tourism too? Eh, Tunco Beach. <laughs> Excuse me, Iván. Nice. Ya, sí, ya, este... ya, ya me voy a dar la dirección para, para ir ahí. <laughs> okay. El primero que está a la entrada del Tunco. <laughs> ok, but there, there is, there, there is the, the, uh, a popular area. Hay un, hay un caminito que es bien popular. O sea, de, de los que vamos a pie, <risa> está el, el, el camino a Surf City. Exacto. Uh, entonces sí. usted está en lado de Surf City. Exactamente, así es. Perdón, ¿cómo se llama? Eh, el, el, es un hotel, es un hotel. Es hotel y eh, restaurant. Hotel y restaurant, ok. Yeah. Good. Sí, eh, este... Perdón por la pregunta, pues... Iván. Eh, ¿Por qué nivel andamos? ¿Normal o estamos así un poquito? <risas> eh, estamos bien, eh, más que todos. O sea, estoy hablando mucho. De, de acá, ¿verdad? <risas> eh, dice que eh, realmente miramos eso, eh, bueno, todos los días. Uh -huh. eh, después, antes eh, era bien baja la, era bien bajo, pero ya cuando se abrió lo que era el camino al Sur City, uh -huh. la nueva carretera ayudó mucho el incremento okay. económico. Okay. Uh, estamos a un 55%, llegamos casi al 90%. Uh, o sea, nice, uh -huh. excelente. Sí, okay. eh, fue casi como el doble. Ok, very good. Uh -huh. So, but the yes. thing is that in, in, well, in my case, when I go with my family, right, we're trying to, to look for, for something, okay, not extremely cheap, but not extremely expensive. You know what I mean, right? You know what I mean. It's <laughs> okay. Eh, sí, okay. este, realmente. Uh, no, because quality is expensive. expensive. Sí. Ivan, quality is expensive, right? If you want something very good, so you have to pay so, for that, right? Very good. Okay. Ah, okay. Sí. Of course, the quality is very. And what is the best dish in the hotel? The best dish, the specialty. The best dish. What is the name of the specialty in the in the hotel? Oh. El mejor plato, el, el, la especialidad de la casa, right? <laughs> <laughs> ¿Cuál sería? Okay. La la langosta rellena. <laughs> Please stop. I'm hungry. <laughs> Okay, nice, Ivan. Sí. Okay, thank you very much. So you are in the tourism. Okay. It's a surprise for me because I have, uh, I am discovering uh, many industries and many hotels and, and restaurants. Nice. Yes. Excellent. Thank you. Now, Son cuatro empresas, teacher. Ah, it's not only one. Excuse me. Okay. Es decir, perdón. Vamos a abordar aquí. Perdón que... Que, que nos desviemos un poquito del inglés, pero eh, quiere decir que Miran tiene cuatro, uh, ¿qué? ¿Restaurantes o hoteles? Hoteles y restaurantes. Estamos a punto de abrir otro, eh, siempre ahí mismo en el Tunco. Ah, ok. Uh, y le voy eh, a cambiar nombre. Roca Sun. Roca. Eh, Roca, Sun, Roca Sunsal es parte del grupo Mira. Eh, eh, Pargos, Pargo de Ocean Grill. Oh. Eh, también el Dale Dale Café oh. y, y Boca Ola, Grupo Boca Mira. Ola. Y el nuevo próximo, el nuevo próximo es Mira Sur. Es Mira Surf. Mira Surf. Mira Surf. Ah, ok, good. Exacto. Please take notes, class. <laughs> Tomen nota ahí para los lugares que van a visitar en, en vacaciones, ¿verdad? Ok, nice. Congratulations. Nice. And you, you, you work in the office, or you work You're, in the restaurant, Ivan? You are uh, ambos. Both, both, both. Both. Excellent. Thank you, Ivan. Thank you very much. Okay. Interesting talking with you right now. Uh, I have... Um,
Jacqueline, no, no, Jacqueline is listening, right? Uh, Joel. Hi, Joel. We're going to finish with you, right? Jafrasa. Jafrasa. Right? Can you tell us something about Jafrasa, Joel? Mr. Barrera Peraza. Okay. Entonces, vamos a terminar con eh, Carlos Amaya. Ah, interesting. Vamos a ver dónde ponemos el negocio de, de, de Carlos Amaya, porque no, no lo ubico aquí en, en ninguno de los que vimos. Carlos, please. Mr. Amaya. Hi. Hi. Can you explain what does your company do, Carlos? Okay, we um, take photos, mm -hmm. familiar photos or uh, photo for documents okay. for the university and something like that. Okay, good. So you are similar to Raf, but better, of course. <laughs> yeah, better. Yeah, that's the idea. Uh, okay, yes. let me see. In what industry we can put... Uh, Robles Studios, right? Where? Um, um, tourism? No, right? Or no. In case industry, lo pondríamos. Let me see what industry. It's difficult for me. Class, can you help us? Nos pueden ayudar, compañeros. Um, artistic industry, maybe. What do you maybe, think? Maybe, yeah. Maybe, right? Yes. Because it's an art. Taking photos is not easy. Yes. And you use a lot of components, of course, right? And what do you do yes. exactly in your company, Carlos? You're the manager, you are you take photos or you're the photographer or what? Yes, I am a photographer and editor. You you edit the, the photo, right? Yeah. Uh, and you are you a graphic designer, uh, Carlos? Kind of that. Kind of, okay. So it's necessary to, to know about how to create what uh, people want, because I imagine the families go to, to your studio and they say, I will want this photo and uh, please take the photo and, and put, put something related with El Tunco Beach, right? <laughs> or oh, yeah. uh-huh. Okay. Yes. Oh, sorry, I have a question because I have a dog. Do they take animals to take pictures in the studio? Um, no, animals. Mm -hmm. no, 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 you don't do that. Okay. <laughs> oh, I yes. because, uh, it's a possibility, right? People love animals a lot, right? Okay. Thank you very much. Yeah, could be. Could be, right? Yeah. Could be, it's a possibility. <laughs> it's an idea for the business. <laughs> yes. Yes. You can say, you want to take picture of your dog, please bring your dog here. <laughs> okay. Good. Thank yes. you very much, class. Uh, I don't continue because of the time, right? Uh, no les pregunto a todos por, por el tiempo. Podemos vamos a hacer un ejercicio en que sí vamos a platicar de todos los negocios. Here. Okay, let's go to the, to the manual, please. I will share the manual. I have a question here. Let me see. Ah, good, Guillermo. Thank you, Guillermo. Sure, no. Alpha, okay. Yeah, I'm going to participate Okay, now let's go to the, to the manual. Good, please open your manual on page 19. Unit number two, soci socializing, socializing, right? Exchange information about the company's expertise, industrial classification, and where it operates, right? Good. Now here we have some questions to, to begin this. To begin, vamos a hacerlo grande para, para el teléfono de Maribel, verdad que a veces muy chiquita que gana letra. Well, come on, so this is the question. Do you often attend seminars? Uh, let me see, the question is to, Teacher, uh, por elegante. Ah, okay. You print the the the, the 
de... Ya, saqué, ya lo saqué, ya lo saqué para no estarlo molestando. No, no, come on, you don't bother me, Maribel. No, no me molesta, es, para eso estamos, ¿va? sir, just sir. <ríe> ok, let me see. Eh, Carlos, y luego vendría uh, Carla, right, Carla, please. Carla, do you attend seminars in your company? Um, disculpe, ¿qué, ¿qué necesito hacer? Ok. This is the question, <laughs> Carla. Okay. Ah, do, do you, you attend uh, seminars que in lo, your company? Que lo lea. No, 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 no. It's a question to you. You ah, work okay. in hotel, hotel Citlali. Citlali. Ah, ¿verdad que lo digo Citlali. bien? Citlali. Sí. <laughs> Sorry, yes. Carla, ¿es Nahuatl o es... Es Nahuatl. Nahuatl. Oh. Nahuatl. Mm -hmm. And what is the meaning? What is the meaning of Citlali? Um, es estrella del viajero. My goodness. Interesting. Mm -hmm. I like it. Es estrella del viajero. Mm -hmm. Nice. Incredible. Okay, so there are seminars in Hotel Citlali for the employees? For you, Carla? Eh, eh, seminaris, seminarios. Mm -hmm. Yes. yes. Um, no, 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 no tiene. Solamente es no, no. alojamiento no, no, para no, no, no. ejecutivos. Ah, okay. Okay, Carla, give me a second. No, I'm asking okay. about the employees, no, no, the, no the, the clients, no the guests, mm -hmm. no, no a los. Uh -huh. No a los... Ah, los empleados. Ajá, okay. yes. Okay. ¿Cómo se dice? Employees. Los huéspedes, huéspedes, guests, guests. Uh -huh. No to the guests. To the guests, no. To the employees. The employees, ok. Uh -huh. um, yes, eh, yes, tres meses, tres meses de, de entrenamiento. Oh, ok. Uh -huh. And when you go to the seminars, Carla, you have some co-worker, right? Compañeros de trabajo, right? Ajá, so, uh -huh, ajá. Uh -huh. It's a personal question. If you don't want, don't answer, right? Si no quiere, no le conteste, pero listen. Is okay. easy for you to socialize with other co-workers? Yes. Okay. okay. Good. And how do you usually break the ice with, with your co-workers? Um, how do you do the... How do you break the ice? ¿Cómo rompe el hielo? How do you break the okay. ice with your... Okay. Con los eh, compañeros, uh -huh. bueno, yes. en, las, en las mañanas. Eh, no, 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 but I'm talking about... Okay, wait, give me a second. Well, okay. in my case, I'm a teacher, right? And when I go to seminars, I uh -huh. go with other people from, for example, Soyapango, eh, San Martín, uh -huh. San Salvador. So normally, I don't work every day with these people. I only see these people in the seminars, only. So that's my question. When you are in these seminars, how do you break the ice with your co-workers from other hotels? Ajá. Ajá. Eh, con otros hoteles. O other employees, otros empleados que no estén dentro ah. del hotel. Ajá, yeah. Okay, okay. Eh, ¿Cómo rompemos el hielo? Yes, yes. Bueno, con pequeña broma nada más. Okay. Very good. It's like, uh, I don't know, sometimes we make jokes about the food, right? Uh, si querían no usar bien algo de comida, porque este pancito no nos va a alcanzar, algo así. <laughs> Something Ajá, like that, right? No, o como por, o como por ejemplo, este, hagámosla todo para comer pupusa <laughs> o comer otra cosa. Okay. okay. Let's put some money to buy pupusa because this food uh -huh. in the seminar is, that is not good, right? Mm -hmm, well, the, okay. the coffee, the coffee in this seminar is horrible. So let's go to buy some cafe uh -huh. outside, right? Okay. Don't mm -hmm. cost cafe, right? Mm -hmm. No, okay. cafe de, de, de cafetera, el común. I know, I understand. It's kind of acid. I don't like it because it's acid. It's... But mm -hmm. anyway, so you sí. break the ice, making small joke, right? Rompe el hielo, eh, haciendo pequeñas bromas, small jokes. Mm -hmm. In English, remember, it says, Jokes. It's como jokes. Uh, jokes. Chistes. Jokes. Uh -huh. I will copy for you. Give me a second. So I'm going to copy it Okay. Jokes. Okay. Bromas or chistes, right? Pepito, for example, 
let's say, uh, eh, mamá, mamá, ajá, Pepito, eh, en la escuela me dicen el despistado, el despistado, no les hagas caso, Pepito, además vos no vivís aquí, esta no es tu casa, ahí enfrente vivís vos, mira, <laughs> ok, so those are the jokes, right? O oh, por okay. ejemplo, this, look at this, eh, eh, Maribel, no, I will say Carla's mother, right? Carla's mother uh, has three kids, right? Three kids. Este es para que el próximo seminario, Carla, usted pregunte esto, oiga. Carla's mother has three kids. Eh, eh. May, April, and... ¿Cómo se llama el tercer niño? De la mamá de Carla, right? Uno se llama May, el otro se llama April y el otro se llama... Abril. April. No, no. Óigame bien, Carlita. Uh -huh. May. Uno se llama May, el otro se llama April y el otro se llama... ¿Cómo se llama? <risa> no sé. Eh, May. Oh, my God. Ok. June. Vamos a decirlo en, en, en español, ¿verdad, Carla? La mamá, uh -huh. de Carla, la mamá de Carla tiene tres hijos. Ma, mayo, abril y... Jun. No. Mayo, Mars. abril. No, mayo, abril y Carla. Mm. Ok. No, mamá. Yes, es, porque es la mamá de, de su mamá. Pues su mamá tiene tres hijos. A usted okay. y a otros dos. <risa> ah, ok. Yo le seguía el, el... La línea de los meses, ¿verdad? Vale, el calendario. Aquí tiene un, un chiste okay. o, un, o un show que puede, con el que puede quebrar el, el, el ice ahí en el próximo seminar. Por aquí, okay. Thank you. Por aquí tengo otro, otro, miren. What has uh, four wheels, four wheels and flies? Four wheels, cuatro llantas and flies. What is it? Um, what has four wheels and flies? What has no four wheels and uh -huh. flies? No sé. No, no sé. No. Vamos a ver a alguien que nos ayude que no encuentro el, el símbolo de pregunta aquí en lo perdido. Ahí está. What? It's in English, right? Okay. Si lo decimos wow. en español, no, 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 no tiene sentido, pero es un more inglés. What has for wheels and flies? What is it? Preguntemos a Carlos Amaya. Please, Carlos. Ayúdeme la Carlita ahí, Carlos. No. Bueno, entonces vámonos con Carlos Vega. Please, Carlos. Carlos Vega. Uh, uy, what what has, four has four wheels and flies, and flies. Uh -huh. que tiene cuatro llantas y vuela. No, I don't know, I'm saying in English. <laughs> what has four wheels and flies? Okay. No, I don't know. <laughs> no, I don't know. A truck garbage. A truck garbage. Si no se ríen, entiendo, porque este es humor gringo, ¿verdad? A truck garbage. ¿Qué tiene cuatro llantas y moscas? Flies. ¿Cómo se dice mosca en inglés? Fly. Uh, ¿Eh? Es que había, pues, había leído fly. No, está bien. ¿Cuál es el plural? ¿Cuál es el plural? Flies. Ok. Flies. Moscas. Moscas. Ajá. ¿Qué tiene cuatro llantas y moscas? Un camión de la basura, ¿verdad? Right? Ok, it's, it's, a, it's, a, it's a trick, right? Una trampa ahí. Good. Pero estamos dando la idea a, a Carlita para que rompa el hielo ahí en el próximo seminario. Okay. Okay. Thank, thank you. you. Thank you, Carla. And we're going to finish with Kevin. Quiero ver, ¿está, está de oyente Kevin? Sí, está de oyente. Entonces vamos con eh, Alicia, please. Alicia. The same question to you, Alicia. Do you attend seminars? Alicia, 
No, no, you don't go to seminar. Oh. Mm. Okay, so uh, Rosy, please help her, Rosy. Hey, teacher. Do, do you attend seminars, Rosy? Or training, teachers? right? Trainings. Training. Va a seminarios o, o a capacitaciones? Uh, on Friday. On Friday. Okay, good. Yes. Now, the same question, Rosie. Is it easy for you to socialize with, with your co-workers, with your, with your partners? Uh, in my work, um, uh, como digo, nos dan. They give us, they give, ya, ya le voy a, a dar la palabra, Alicia. Solo okay. termino aquí con Rosie, okay. Ah, Rosy. Ah, uh, eh, they give us, ellos nos dan. They give us um, capacitation. Training, uh, trainings, trainings. Trainings. Mm -hmm. uh, primeros auxilios, no sé cómo okay. decir. Okay, first aid. First, first aid. aid. Okay. I, I will copy for you. We'll copy. Es, aparte del trabajo. Mm -hmm. First aid. Eh, trainings, capacitaciones de first aid training. Once, once a month, um, a month, once a month, once a month, once a month. Ajá, en, en, en primeros auxilios, ¿cómo es? En... First aid, first aid. First aid, eh, every... Friday. Every Friday. Okay. Now, but listen to the question, Rosy. Is easy okay. for you, is, is not difficult for you to socialize with your co-workers? Mm. Or you, mm. you are at the corner like this, only? No, no. Or you no. are in the, in the parloteo, right? I am <laughs> speaking <laughs> every, <laughs> every people. <laughs> you like you like to gossip, gossip. <laughs> gossip, look, chambrear, right? <laughs> yes. <laughs> yes, yes teacher. Mira el vestido que ha traído aquel, okay, sí, vos. Tú ves no. el que trae. <laughs> ok. Yo no trabajo con señoras. Ah, ok. No, yo well. no trabajo con niños. Ah, oh, sorry, excuse. O sea, con, con muchachos, pues, con, con hombres, caballeros. I understand. El trabajo okay. es solo de hombres. Oh, excuse me. Mm -hmm. okay. okay. Now, the question is, to finish, how do you usually break the ice? Me dices si tengo un break. No, 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 no. no. Break, break the ice means cómo rompe el hielo con sus compañeros. Cuando están los seminarios, ¿de qué hablan? Pues, ¿cómo comienzan las pláticas? Um, how do you break the ice? Um, I, I do a question. Ah, you make questions. Good. Uh -huh. uh, uh, question, question, question. Uh, hey, Nisan, a preguntar todo. The, <laughs> yes, everybody start talking. Yes. yes, okay. Mm -hmm. So, make jokes, uh, make questions. You also can introduce a topic, for example, uh, today, uh, one of the most common topics is uh, the traffic, right? The traffic, because uh, in ah. San Salvador, it's a chaos because the motorcycles, uh, they, are, they are following the lane, right? Ahora las motocicletas la están obligando que vayan en el lugar correcto. So, but the traffic is yeah. horrible, right? So it's a topic. Yes. It's a small talk. Uh, small talk, right? Here. Where want to go? Here to, to, here to, um, se lo voy a decir en español. Aquí okay. hay un redondel donde está, están construyendo y está feo. Ok. No, pero no le diga así, mm. pobrecito. Ah, usted dice el lugar. Ah, oh, sorry. <laughs> okay. El lugar. No, no, no. Okay. El lugar. El lugar. Ok. Joe, question. Listen to Rosy. Questions. You can make questions. And also small talk, small talk, right? Podemos hablar, por ejemplo, que el Barça ganó ahora dos a uno, ¿verdad? 
a, a ocho puntos de un equipo de blanco, no sé cómo se llama el equipo. Bueno, so, small que talk. mañana pierde el Madrid con el Valencia. Sí, ojalá. Ok, <risa> okay. small talk, es un tema del tráfico, del clima, de, de fútbol. Uh -huh. De política no le recomiendo, ni de religión, porque siempre hay pleito. <risa> ok, yeah. But small talks, se llaman pláticas pequeñas, ¿no? Entonces, when you go to seminars, you break the ice, como escuchamos a Carla, right, jokes, o como escuchamos a Rosy, making questions, right, o making small talks. Very good, thank you very much. Now let's go to the conversation, please. Let me see what time is it. Good, I will take the tennis, please. Uh, Adelia? No. Okay, Brian? Present. Thank you. Uh, Carlos Vega? Present. Thank you, Carlos. Clarissa? Present teacher. Okay, thank you, Miss Ramos. Uh, Daniel? Present teacher. Maribel? Maribel? Present teacher. Thank you, Elmer? Miss Miranda Coreas, Mr. Sorry, excuse me, Mr. Eh, Miranda Coreas, no. Present teacher. Okay, sorry, sorry, perdón, Elmer, perdón, perdón por el... está fallando, está fallando el inter, perdón. Ah, pero, entonces no escuchó, no escuchó, okay, sí. Thank you, thank you, Elmer. So I say Mr. Miranda Corea, right, thank you. Erika. Present teacher. Thank you, thank you, Guillermo. Present teacher. Thank you, Ivan. Present teacher. Thank you, Jacqueline. Present. Good, thank you. Eh, sigue de oyente, ¿verdad? Jacqueline, no hay problema, yo entiendo. Eh, Guillermo, perdón, ¿verdad que me envió un, un, un WhatsApp ahora, Guillermo? Eh, no, teacher, no, WhatsApp, no, no, no. no. Perdón, perdón, es que. No. Perdonen que me pierda con los nombres, pero a veces leo los WhatsApp que me mandan y entonces me equivoco ahí, pero no, no hay problema, Guillermo. Excuse me, excuse me. No, no era okay, un okay, okay. Sorry. Joel. Present teacher. Thank you. Eh, Carlos Amaya. Here. Thank you. Carla. Present teacher. Thank you, Kevin. Kevin, Giovanni, y creo que Giovanni porque me envió el, corre, el mensaje. Bueno, ok. Eh, Alicia. Present teacher. Thank you. Mirna. Mirna. Aquí están presentes. Vamos a ver. Uh, Giovanni, sí, ya está. Ok, thank you, Giovanni. Thank you. And Mirna, right? Thank you, Mirna. Estela? Estela? Okay, Rosy? Present teacher. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Okay, let's continue. Let's continue. Let's go to the conversation here. Ah, oh, excuse me, I have a question here. Uh, Kevin, okay, Kevin, thank you, Kevin. Um, very good. Sigue doyente, Kevin, ¿verdad? Okay, thank you, thank you very much. Good. Now, here we have a conversation, right? Give me a second. Here. Okay. There is a seminar. And in the seminar, we have uh, two co-workers, uh, Rick and Jack, and they are talking. He says, my name is Rick. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you too. I'm Jack. I work for Enix Inc. What does Enix Inc. do, Jack? We manufacture cardboard boxes for packaging companies. 
Oh, I see. Does Enix have many branches? Yes, it does. We have three manufacturing branches in the country. And where are the headquarters? They're in Panama. Good. And then we have here the concept of what a uh, headquarters is, right? The place where a company or organization has its main office. And a branch, a shop or office representing a large company or organization in a particular area, right? Those are the branches, sucursales. Now, listen and repeat, please. Listen and repeat. My name is Rick. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you too. I'm Jack. I work for Inex Inc. What does Inex Inc. do, Jack? What does Inex Inc. do, Jack? We manufacture, manufacture cardboard boxes. We manufacture cardboard boxes. For packaging companies. For packaging companies. Packaging. Cardboard. Manufacturer. Oh, I see. Does Enix have many branches? Yes, it does. We have three manufacturing branches in the country. We have three manufacturing branches in the country. And where are the headquarters? Headquarters. And where are the headquarters? They're in Panama. There, not there, no, it's there in Panama. Okay, good. Now we'll read the conversation for the last time. My name is Rick. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you too. I'm Jack. I work for Inex Inc. Mm, what does Inex Inc. do, Jack? We manufacture cardboard boxes for packaging companies. Oh, I see. Does Inex have many branches? Yes, it does. We have three manufacturing branches in the country. And where are the headquarters? They're in Panama. Okay, very good. Now, uh, imagine the conversation between Jack and Rick continue, right? They continue with the conversation, right? What possible, uh, Questions, do you imagine uh, Rick can make uh, to, to Jack? ¿Qué posibles preguntas puede hacerle eh, Rick a Jack, right? Vamos a tratar de, de encontrar al menos dos. After they finish the, the, this conversation, right? Después que ellos terminan esta conversación, Uh, Rick le hace algunas preguntas a Jack. ¿Cuáles podrían ser esas preguntas? Vamos a darle unos segunditos. ¿sí?
teacher, uh, yes, continuing the conversation or our new, no, no, uh -huh. no, 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 continue with the conversation, right? In between okay. Rick and Jack, remember, okay, let, let me focus on this. Give me, give me a second, Carlos. Uh, let's see that Jack works for Inex Inc., right? So maybe uh, Rick is making more questions about Inex company, right? Okay, Carlos, what could be one possible extra question? Uh... Okay, they're, they're in Panama, okay, uh, really? Uh, Panama is beautiful. There are uh, still place, places. Okay, nice. Because they're talking about the branches that are in Panama, right? Good, thank you, Carlos. Good observation. Now, anybody else? Okay. Otro voluntario, otro que me quiera decir? Uh, una pregunta que le hace Rick a Jack. ¿Le puedo responder en español? Yes, yes, come on. Vaya, eh, le, está, le está preguntando a dónde trabaja. Y le uh -huh. dijo de que él trabajaba para una, una fábrica de, de cajas Ca para impactar okay. cajas. Y que, que eh, son tres compañías que están en Panamá. Ok. Good, but it says branches, right? Branches. In the country, right? In this case, the country is El Salvador, right? So we have uh, three branches in El Salvador and the headquarters or las oficinas principales, el cuartel general, si quieren decirlo así, ¿verdad? Porque headquarters oh. es una palabra militar, ¿no? Entonces, el cuartel principal or well, the oficinas principales, the headquarters, are in Panama. So the headquarters in Panama and three branches in El Salvador, right? Understand? Okay, that's correct. But listen to the question, please. Uh -huh, okay, good question, uh, Joel, yes. Look at the question that possible, because the, the, the situation is to make, to continue with the conversation, okay? Maybe uh, they're talking about the pupusas in El Salvador, right? I don't know. Yes. And Joel makes this. Look. Miren lo que dice Joel, que tal vez pudo haber dicho. And how is the weather in Panama? Okay. Concuerda un poco con lo que nos decía Carlos Vega, ¿verdad? ¿Qué tal es? ¿Cómo son las cosas ahí en Panama? Okay, good. Another possible question. Una más y terminamos. Um, how many people, how many people work in your company? Excellent. How many people work in your company? Perfect, right? Oh, Other teacher. possible. Listen, uh -huh. yes, yes. Or how often do you do seminars? How often do you do seminars? Because they are in a seminar. Nice. Okay. Good. Other possible question is, uh, uh, let me see. What branch are you assigned to, right? A qué, a qué sucursal estás asignado en, o en qué sucursal trabajas tú, right? What branch do you work in? Uh, and where are the branches of Inex in El Salvador, right? Where, where are they located, right? Or do you produce other products, et cetera, et cetera. Could be many questions, many questions, right? Okay. Now we're going to make a list of some companies and branches and where the headquarter is, right? I will copy some for you, some examples, okay? I will copy some examples. Look, uh, let's talk about, for example, what company? Let me see. Uh, Avenger. Sorry? Company, Aveinberg. Aveinberg. Ave in web. Ave. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. In. 
y creo que luego va B de B. B. O B. B, B, de, de las dos pancitas. <risa> Primera vez que escuché la de... e, V. Es, es que esa A, B, B es la que tiene todo el conglomerado de las bebidas de, ah, de Coca-Cola. Entonces, entonces sería así. Eh, in, ah, sí sería. De Ajá. In. Ok. A, B, mm. in, in. Lleva E, lleva E y V. A, B, B, y va unido in. Beverage. De be beverage. Ajá, ahora ya entendí mm. beverage. Ok. And do they have branches in El Salvador? Yes, la constancia. La constancia, right? I didn't know, no sabía. La constancia, right? Hay algunos de aquí que se les alegró los ojitos cuando dicen la constancia, no sé por qué. I don't understand. Excuse me. No okay. ten, tengo idea ni por qué. Ok, en the headquarters, las oficinas centrales de AVMB. En, creo, maybe en México. México. Ok. Um, México. Creo, creo. Let's say yes. México, right? Ah, the idea sí, sí, is to, to understand the, the concept, right? That's the idea. Mm -hmm. Ok, let's go to another example. Let me see. Inco. Inco. They make glasses, right? And, and mirrors. Hacen productos de, de vidrio. Y de espejos también. Is the, the headquarters are in Soyapango. Soyapango en eh, Belloso. El mercado Belloso tiene una sucursal, right? Belloso en Centro. And the headquarters are in eh, eh, Troncal del Norte, right? Carretera Troncal del Norte. Mm -hmm. Es, están a la par de la, de la uno. Ya saliendo de la troncal, ¿no? Ya llegando a la 5 de noviembre. 5 de noviembre, ¿right? Ahí están esas oficinas de, de la INCO, ¿right? Ok, other example could be, let me see. Eh, ad hoc. Unilever. 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 Mm -hmm. Let's talk about Unilever, right? Yo Molsa, decir, teacher. Molsa, too, yeah. Mol. Molsa, Unilever. <laughs> bueno, vamos a Ramolsa. Eh, the headquarters are in, in, no, the branches are in Ciudad Arce. Solo esa, solo esa sucursal me puedo de Molsa. Ciudad Arce. And the main offices are in Boulevard del Ejército, right? Yes. Ejército Boulevard. El ejército Cabal. pasa ahí. El... <risa> ok. Pero ahí pasa el micro, ¿verdad? A dura sí. pena van pasando por el tráfico. Pero... Ok. Ok. Eh, ad hoc. Eh, deja branches en Guatemala. Ad hoc. Right. And the main office of the headquarters are in eh, Mon Colonia Monte Carmelo. Soy a Pango, right? Y la sal. Adelantito de Plaza Mundo está Monte Carmelo. Ah, uh -huh, <laughs> yes. So ad hoc sí. is in Monte Carmelo. Yes, it's true. Monte Carmelo, sí. Yes. Y la sal has branches in Sonsonate and Ciudad Arce. And the, the headquarters is in Sitio del Niño, Sitio del Cipote, right? <laughs> okay. Fruit of the Loom. Fruit of the Loom. Uh, branches of Fruit of the Loom? Uh -huh. O lo cuilca, una, no. Una zona, no. Esa es una zona franca, pero están con, en tres zonas francas. O sea, es una que una. Ok, en uh -huh. eh, Fruto de Looms, it's. I will copy, look. Vamos a copiar aquí arriba, Fruto de Looms, right? Para los que no saben qué significa. Ok. Um, hay un. como un, una caracola. ¿Sí? Que según la creencia, eh, eh, esa caracola se da la abundancia, la abundancia de comida, la abundancia de dinero, de bebida, de todo. Entonces, eh, de ahí viene esta palabra, the fruits of the loom, que es esa caracola grandota, ¿no? Yo no sé si han visto un, un dibujo viejito que va así, es pequeñita, y luego se hace grande, y eh, adelante tiene uvas y 
mango y mil, pero no sé qué otra fruta tendrá ahí. De ahí viene. Entonces, frutos del lomo. Uh, en varias maquilas, ¿verdad? Está, pero ¿dónde estará la headquarters de frutos del lomo? Uh, ¿Sabe alguien? En, creo que es Estados Unidos. United States, ¿ok? United States. Good. Other company. Los asaditos de Don Joel. No, it's not a company. <laughs> it's a restaurant, no. Los asados de Don Joel. <laughs> okay, very good. Now let's continue, please. Let's continue. Digamos entonces. Okay. Good. It says match the product service to the corresponding industry type, right? For example, uh, number one, banks. Banks is the finance industry. Look, what is the soft drink? Okay, please complete. I will give you just two minutes, right? Two minutes. Complete, please. Let's complete. Eh, en lo que completan el ejercicio, vamos a ver quién se va a quedar conmigo esta noche. Ten minutes extra. Eh, Carlos Vega. Can you stay with me, Carlos? Okay. Ten extra minutes. Good. Thank you. The one-to-one -one session, right? Okay. Ya tuve sesión con Adelia, con Brian, uh, con Clarissa y con Daniel, ¿verdad? Interesting topic, right? Interesting topic. Now, tonight, with Carlos Vega. Good. Cool. Let's, let's continue, right? Volunteers, raise your hand, please. Raise your hands. Soft drinks. Uh huh, Carlos. Mr. Vega. A little H. Letter H. Number two. Cling. Correct, right? Number three, guided tours. Class, volunteers, raise your hands, please. Hands up. Guided tours. What kind of industry is the guided tours? For example, in in the downtown San Salvador, right? The tower guided tour is in um the tour industry. The tour industry, right? Tour pues, eso nos iba a decir también, verdad, Joel? El nueve. No, no, el nueve. Yes, <laughs> yes. yes no. Number three, right? Oh. Excuse me, the El Nueve. No, go on. <laughs> Letter I, right? Good. So the guided tours is the tourism industry. Thank you. Now, cardboard boxes, volunteers, please. But raise your hands, please. Raise your hands. Come on, do it. Okay. The cardboard boxes. Uh huh. Carlos, Carlos Vega. Little G. Little G, right? The packaging industry, right? So that's number four. Nice. Number five, buildings. Aquí se lleva la L de buildings. Letter <laughs> B. Uh, Brian, letter B. B. And B. Daniel too, right? Letter G. B. B, 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 the construction here, right? No, uh, no, 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 number six, no. Numbers, no, no, I'm talking about number five, buildings. Okay, you say letter B, right? Letter B, right? Ya me dijeron la letra, la letra B, así que no se echen para atrás. <laughs> okay, number five, right? Good. Joel, please. Number six, Number six. Number six. Uh, Model. Number six, letter. Letter B. Letter D. Letter D. Letter D, right? Letter D. So number six. La Clarixa. Number seven, Clarixa. No, medicine. Sí, hay que letter G. J. 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 Letter J, right? Letter like J. In, like in. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Good. 
So seven, seven right? Deep. Thank yep. you very much, Clarissa. Good. Now, uh, car components. Volunteer, please raise your hands. Raise your hands. Volunteers. The little A's. Letter the A. Automotive industry. Ah, letter A. Little F. 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 Okay, letter F. F. Thank you very much. The car company, right? Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you very much. Now, the next one is hair salon service, right? No, Duli, no es para vos, es para los estudiantes. Okay, Daniel, please. Number nine. Letter? Letter A. Okie dokie. And to finish, Daniel, please. The textile. Yes, is a letter C. Letter C, right? Number 10. Textile industry. Okay, class, you have the answer, right? Now, to finish the class, we're going to do something. Okay, give me a second. Aquí tengo una pregunta. Letter A. Okay, thank you, Giovanni. Thank you, Giovanni. Aquí nos dio una respuesta también, Giovanni. Good. Now, we're going to do something, right? Uh, this part we made it, right? Esta parte ya la hicimos, creo. Sí, así que vamos a quedarnos con la conversación. Let me see. I'm going to erase this. Okay. It says, prepare a two-minute conversation about your companies. Uh -huh. Describe the company's expertise, its industrial classification, and the location, right? Eh, ¿A qué se dedica su compañía? ¿Qué tipo de industria está clasificado? ¿Y en dónde está? Yes, three things. ¿Qué es lo que hacen en su compañía? Right? Eh, ¿En qué tipo de industria está localizado? ¿Y en qué lugar está el headquarters y los branches? Right? ¿En dónde están ubicadas las, las sucursales y los, las oficinas? What are you going to do, class? Listen. This is the model conversation. Aquí tenemos la conversación modelo, right? My name is Rick. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you too. I'm Jack. I work for Inex Inc. What does Inex uh, Inex Inc? Microphone encendido por acá. Okay, good. Uh, what does Inex Inc do, Jack? We manufacture cardboard boxes for packaging company. Oh, I see. Does Enix have many branches? Yes, it does. We have three manufacturing branches in the country. And where are the headquarters? They're in Panama. Okay, so I will make the couples. And tell me if you can make it, right? Uh, Adelia? And, and Brian, right? Adelia, you are Rick. And Brian, you are Jack. Entonces, ¿qué me va a hacer? ¿Qué me va a hacer Brian? En lugar de decir Inex, me va a decir Misión Bautista. Okay? And Adelia is going to say, my name is Adelia. Nice to meet you. Y Brian va a decir, nice to meet you too. I'm Brian. I work for Misión Bautista. What does Mission Bautista do, Brian? We uh, give education or we provide social programs, Brian? Perdón, que ande perdido, ¿verdad? Mission Bautista hace proyectos sociales, eh, educativos. Yes, it's como, hay varios proyectos ahí, en el colegio. Entonces, digamos, eh, si gusta para que todos entendamos y, y estemos en la sintonía, we give uh, educational programs. ¿Le parece? Mm -hmm. Ok, educational programs, right? Ok, oh, I see. Does, in, does Misión Bautista have many branches? 
y ahí se va este, Brian explicando lo de misión bautista, ¿ok? Good. Ahora la siguiente pareja va a ser eh, Carlos Pega en Clarissa. Uh, Clarissa, you are letter, you are Rick. En Carlos Pega, you are Chuck. ¿Ok? Luego tenemos a, a Daniel con Maribel. Daniel, you are Jack. En Maribel, you are Rick. ¿Ok? I repeat. Daniel, you are Jack. En Maribel, you are Rick. The next couple is Elmer. Elmer, you are Rick. En Erika, you are Jack. Elmer is Rick. En Erika is Jack, right? Guillermo. Guillermo is Rick. And Ivan is Jack. Eh, Joel, you are Rick. And Carlos Vega is Jack. Okay. Carla Beatriz. Carla, you are Rick. And... Uh, en Alicia, Alicia y Jack, right? En the last one, Rosy, you are, uh, you are Rick. En me, the teacher, I will help you, Rosy. I am, I am Jack, right? Okay. Sorry, teacher. Mm, no entendí con quién. Lo... Okay. I will repeat the, the couple. Voy a repetir las la, la parejitas, okay? Adelia and Brian. Carlos Vega en Clarixa, Daniel en Maribel, Elmer en Erika, Guillermo en Iván, eh, Guillermo en Iván, eh, Joel en Carlos Amaya, Carla en Alicia, en Rosibel en The Teacher. Ok, so... Now, I am letter, I am, an, I am Jack, and Rosie, you are Rick. Ready, Rosie? Okay, give me a second. Ladies and gentlemen, directly from Hollywood, California. Huh? Conversation. My name is Rosie. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you, too. I am Javier. I work for English Corporativo. Oh. What does English Cooperativo do, Javier? Ah, we give uh, English and computer program. Oh, I see. That's English Cooperativo. How many branches? Uh, yes, it does. Uh, we have. Aquí sí no estoy seguro, pero. <laughs> We have three branches in El Salvador, in Santa Ana, San Salvador, and in San Miguel. And where are the high courts? They are in Colonia Escalón, next to the Cheraton Hotel. <laughs> okay, thank you. Cla class to, to Rosibel, right? Thank you very much, Rosibel. Thank you. <laughs> Okay, Good. Now, let's begin with uh, Adelia and Brian. Are you ready? This... Adela is Rick and Brian is Jack. Okay, give me a second. Teacher. One, uh, yes. ¿Qué me dijo que era? You, are, you are Jack. No, no, uh, del... Usted le va a contestar a Adelia todo lo que le pregunte de Misión Bautista, ¿ok? Y que Misión Bautista give educational program, dijimos, ¿verdad? Yeah, give education. educational program, ¿ok? Yo sé que Misión Bautista tiene otro rubro, pero vamos a ir por ahí por la educación, ¿ok? Ready? One, two, three, action. Nice, Adelia. Nice to meet you. Uh, nice, to, uh -huh. nice to meet you. Nice to meet you too. I am Jack. I am no, no, no. You are Brian. You are Brian. Ah, yeah. mm -hmm. so, uh, I, I am Brian. I am work for Mission Bautista. What does Mission Bautista do, Brian? 
Uh, we, um, we, give, we give, we give, we give, we give an education program. Oh, see, sí. that's Mission Bautista. How many branches? Okay. <clears throat> ¿Qué sería ahí? Eh, ¿Sucursales? Bueno, sí, yeah. hay bastante filiales. Ok, ok. Yes, it does. Repeat. Yes. Yes. Yes, it does. Ok. ¿Cuántas eh, branches o cuántas oficinas sucursales cree que hay en el país? Son como 500, 600. Ah, en El Salvador. Tú sabes cómo son. Ajá, es que están, entiendo que es la, las iglesias. Ajá. Ah, muy bien. Entonces, sí, 500, digamos. 500. Pongamos un número Brian, para terminar la conversación. We have 500. Repeat. 500. 500, ok. Branches. Continue, continue. Branches in. Branches in, in San Salvador. Ajá, uh -huh, okay. Adelia? And where are the headquarters? They here in San Salvador. The headquarters are in San Salvador, okay. Excelentoso, excelentoso, right? Let's continue. Next couple is Carlos Vega and Clarissa, right? Ready? One, two, three, action. My name is Clarissa. Nice to meet you. Can me uh, Nice to meet you too. I am Carlos and I work for a bank, Cuscatlan. What a bank. Cuscatlán. Cuscatlán Bank. Cuscatlán Bank. Okay. We manage uh, the portfolio of business clients. Oh, I see that. Um, but Cuscatlán. Cuscatlán Bank. Cuscatlán Bank. Cuscatlán Bank. Bank. Does Cuscatlan Bank have many branches? Repeat. Okay. Does uh, Cuscatlan Bank have many branches? Yes, it does. Uh, we have more than 40 branches. Uh, uh, where are the headquarters? Uh, the headquarters is in Santa Tecla. Santa Tecla, right? La Pirámide, yes or no? Yes. Congratulations, Carlos and Clarissa. Thank you very much. Next couple, uh, Daniel and Maribel. Ready? Yeah. Yes, okay, ladies and gentlemen, directly from Hollywood, California. Action. My name is Daniel. Nice to meet you. Maribel? Perdón. No, to me, you, to, I am back. No, I am Maribel. I, I am Maribel. No, no. <laughs> no lo sé, Rick. Pero sé que todavía estoy. Ok, otra vez. Repeat, Daniel. Please. My name is Daniel. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you, too. I am Maribel. I go for teacher, ayúdeme. No entiendo. Okay, ahí. I work for eh, I work for Corpo Velo. Uh, yes. Come on, I work for I go 
for Corpovelo? What does in Corpovelo, Maribel? What does Corpovelo do? Repeat, Dani. What does Corpovelo do, Maribel? Administrative assistance. No, 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 but, but the company. We say that you, you give health program, yes? Habíamos quedado de acuerdo, Maribel, que Corpovelo proporciona eh, programas de salud integral, pues. Eh, okay. so, eh, mm -hmm. health, health program, vamos a escribirlo para que todos lo vean, okay. ¿verdad? Déjale un segundo. Give health programs, right? Okay. Oh, man, así para, para decir en inglés. Okay, come on. What does Corpovelo do, Maribel? Have. We. A program. We give. We give. We give. We will give. Health. Programs. Health, health programs. Oh. I see. Does Corpovelo have many brushes? No. No, it doesn't. No. no. Repeat. No, it doesn't. Um, wait, 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 wait. Maribel, no, it doesn't. No. It doesn't. In, it doesn't. No, it doesn't. And um, where are the headquarters? ¿Dónde están las oficinas principales? ¿Dónde está la clínica principal, Maribel? Um, Salvador, Nuevo Cucatlán. Eh, eh, Nejapa. Salvador Boulevard Hipodro Colonia San Benito Boulevard El Hipodro San Benito Colonia San Benito Ok, San Benito Nebo Ok, ok Ok, sorry class Perdón que antes no fue la, la clase ¿verdad? Solo este eh, Vamos a llegar hasta aquí Perdón, sorry I don't know if you have any extra question no, vaya, okay. es que quiero compartirles el. Me recuerdan que, que hasta, hasta Maribel llegamos con la práctica de conversación para que la otra conversación le demos más énfasis al otro compañero. Muy bien. Uh, we're going to go to the, to the platform. Let me see. Here, right? The platform. Este, en lo que abro la sección 2, uh, quiero darles el, la nota, ¿verdad? Este, de lo que ya, ya me completaron, ¿no? Este, el, la tarea de la sección 1, ¿sí? Muy bien. Uh, pues aquí pueden contestar una de las opciones que relativas a the beauty and personal care industry, right? So, one of the actions. Eh, the beauty and personal care industry is guided tours, building, hair salon services, medicine, or mobile phone, right? So you're going to check only one. Good. Eh, aprovecho para felicitar a la mayoría que me ha completado la plataforma. Recuérdense que este, el único, la única tarea difícil era la 4, ¿verdad? Pero ya la vimos ayer, así que espero que ya sepan cómo resolver. Eh, Brian Alexander todavía puede llegar a, la, a, las, a las tareas y volver a hacer, ¿verdad? Porque la nota queda un poquito baja, Brian, puede hacerla. Eh, Carlos Vega, si necesito que me complete las cinco tareas. Clarixa no. también puede subir un poquito más, Clarixa. A la nota que tiene. Eh, Daniel tiene 100, ya no puede subir más. Lo felicito. Sí, mandé. Lo terminó. Ah, bueno. Ya no, si ya lo terminó, así como cuando le, le manda una nota a sí. uno. 
de usted debe al banco, debe pagar. <ríe> y si ya pagó, haga caso omiso a la, a la presente okay. nota. <ríe> ok, si ya llegó al 100, pues perfecto. Sí, sí. Va, muy bien. Ok, Maribel. Es el también. cobro del, de, de los recibos. Es el cobro de los recibos, ahorita estoy cobrando. Hagan de cuenta que trabajo para Blanco, Banco Atlántida, Banco Cucatlán y Crédito de Negocios. Estoy cobrando, ¿sí? <ríe> Elmer y Maribel, necesito que lleguen al 100, ¿sí? Por favor. Eh, Erika ya tiene el 100, le felicito. <ríe> Guillermo, no me ha completado ninguna tarea, así que por favorcito ahí me echa la mano. Iván, 96. Pitcher, perdón. Pitcher. Sí, sí. Te escucho, Maribel. Yo creo que ya llegué hasta el 6. Ahora el mediodía lo hice. Y no, 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 pero, pero es que, que, permítame. Hay cinco tareas en la sí. sección en la sección 1. Ahorita le muestro. En la sección 1 hay cinco tareas. ¿sí? La 4 es la que más nos costó, ¿se acuerda? Tarea 1, 2, 3. 4 y 5. Si usted le falta una de estas tareas, entonces le aparece una nota como de 70, creo. O 60. Okay. Sí. Entonces tiene que hacer las cinco tareas para llegar al 100%. ¿Enteraron? ¿Estamos, Maribel? Sí. Sí, va, vale, muy bien. Profe, gracias. Tiene tiempo todavía, no se preocupe, Maribel. Eh. Jacqueline tiene 100, o él ya casi llega al 100. Carlos Amaya tiene 100. Carla, pues necesito que me complete las tareas, ¿verdad? Porque ahí me parece que no ha trabajado hasta el momento. Oiga, eh, es seguro que va a sacar un 10, Carla, eso es seguro. Sí. Eh, Kevin casi llega al 10, por un pelito, Kevin. Eh, Giovanni tiene 100, Alicia tiene 100. Eh, Mirna ya casi llega al 100, le falta poquito. Estela tiene 100 y Rosy tiene 2 de nota. No mentira, Rosy. No, tiene 100. Ah, ajá, Kevin. Dí, dígame, Kevin. Eh, esas notas, teacher, las ha actualizado en este momento. No, 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 no. Ayer, estas ayer, no son desde ayer. Por eso ah, les okay, digo, sí. si, si ya le hicieron, si ya llegaron al 100. Hacer caso omiso de esta nota de cobro. <ríe> Parece claro. No lo sé, Rick. Parece claro que ahora me, co me cobraron y ya pagué. Ah, yo no fui. <ríe> pagué. Ya pagó. Ya pagó. Ya pagó. Ok, muy bien. Me quedé. Hay que pagar, hay, hay que pagar la hipoteca, si no nos quedamos sin nada. Sí, vaya, consejos de los que trabajan en banco. Paguen la hipoteca, lo demás. Vayan a ser tunco después. <ríe> ya se van a dar comida. <ríe> ok. Noche, es que la cosa de las pastillas, la clorofenamina vale, me bien. da sueño. Voy a pasar el, el list, listado y lo veremos mañana. Solo me quedo con este, Carlos Vega, solo con Carlos me quedo. Eh, Adelia, ¿tiene alguna pregunta? Okay. Sí, Richard, no escuché cuánto dijo que tenía yo. Como dos mil creo que tiene, permítame. Cien. Cien. Ya complementó el curso. Ya com no, va comenzando. Pero ahí tiene una nota, Adelia. Dice, gracias Kevin por pasarme la copia. ¿Y por qué dice eso, Adelia? No, no entiendo. I don't know. Porque él ayuda y a mí no me ha ayudado. <risa> Brian, ¿tiene alguna pregunta? Sí, no, no sé si la tarea 7 voy, pero no entiendo qué se va a hacer. Ya, ya voy un momentito, solo escucho a Brian, permítame. Brian. Eh, no sé si ya está ahí lo de la tarea. Ya la, ya, si ya eh, subió. No, eh, voy a revisarlo después de la clase, pero ah, sí, le, le, le faltaba un poquito, Brian. Okay, está. Gracias. Sí. Así es que si no lo ha completado, pues, ¿verdad? Eh, ¿Alguien más me va a hacer una pregunta antes de pasar el listado y, no, y nos vamos? ¿No? Ok. ¿Adelia? Present. Present. Thank you. Goodbye. See you tom eh, tomorrow. Ok. See you. Brian. <coughs> Sorry. Brian. Present. Thank you. Bye bye. Eh, Carlos. 
Carlos Vega? Present. Yes, ahí me espera, Carlos, please. Eh, Clarixa? Present, teacher. Thank you. Present. That... Okay, thank you, Clarixa. Bye bye. Daniel? Present, teacher. Bye. Thank you. Bye bye. Maribel? Bye. Maribel? Okay, bye bye. Elmer? Present, teacher. Okay, bye bye, Elmer. Have a good night. Erika? Present, teacher. Thank you, Guillermo? Ivan? Present teacher, bye bye. Thank you, bye bye. Jacqueline? Joel? Okay, thank you. Thank you, Jacqueline. See you tomorrow, teacher. See you tomorrow, Joel. Bye bye. Carlos Amaya? Here, bye. Bye, take care, Carla? Present Kevin? teacher. Okay, thank Na you, thank you. Night. Good night, night night. Bye bye. <laughs> Uh, Kevin? Present teacher. Thank you. Have a good night. Giovanni? Good night. Alicia? Present teacher. Thank you. Bye bye. Mir uh, Alicia, sorry. Mirna? Estela? And Rosie? Rosie? Present teacher. Thank you. See you tomorrow. Okay, bye bye. Uh, Carla, please. See you tomorrow. See you tomorrow. Carla. You too, you too, Rosy. God bless you. Carla? Carla, Carla, hello. Present teacher. Okay, thank you. Have a good night. See you tomorrow. Good night. Okay. See you. See you. Uh, Giovanni and Guillermo, ya les tomé la asistencia. Ya pueden ir, irse a, a mimir. <ríe> ok, let me see. Carlos, nos quedamos con usted ahora. Let me see. Let de acuerdo. Me see. Vamos a cerrar aquí lo que tengo. Permítame, Carlos. Y aquí tengo a um, Mirna. Muy bien, Mirna. Thank you very much. Y también, bueno, solamente Mirna, ¿verdad? Ok, good. Good. Bueno, por ahí se quedó Guillermo y Giovanni, que están trabajando, creo. Sí. Ok, Carlos, if you want, you can turn on your camera, Carlos. Ok, very good. So, it's a pleasure to see you again. I was afraid, Carlos, I would say, hey, Carlos. Uy, Carlos nos dejó. Teacher, teacher eh, se está trabando un poco. Se escucha eh, como trabado. Ok. Vamos a esperar un momentito entonces. ¿Ahora? One, two. Ahorita three. sí. Sí, sí, ok. Yes. Eh, I sí. Was te, Carlos, I was telling you that I was afraid that, that you had quit the, the course. Estaba un poco preocupado que pensé que había dejado el curso. Dije yo. No, no. Ok, nice. So what is your opinion of the course, Carlos? What do you think? I like it, I like it, uh, but uh, let me see. I have a uh, problems, uh, I have uh, problems connecting because on ah. uh, Thursday, on and Thursday, I have a meeting at the church. And, I understand. Ah, in the and, church. Yes. So you uh, have activities, you have activities in Bank of Quetland? And you have activities in your church. Yes, and uh, the last week I was a promo, uh, promoted, pro, promoted, 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 promoted. And I am a training alone with, uh, in a training in, in with my previous job. And ah, same. I understand. Good. So you're a good employee. <laughs> you're a nice. A <laughs> yeah. Oh no. A little bit. If you have recognition for your company, yes. that you're good. Yes. 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 Okay. Uh, uh, have you checked the the messages in the WhatsApp group? I mean, the the, the presentations. Yes. 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 Did, did you check some of the presentation of the previous classes? Yes. And, and yes. Yes. Good. See, see, Basically, uh, at this moment, the the three most difficult parts are infinitives. Yeah. Gerunds, 
ing words ing and passive voice the passive voice right do you want to review one of these three topics carlos or, or it's okay for you 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 have no questions mm, no no no, pro no problem it, uh, the grammar is hard for me but uh -huh. Don't worry, the grammar no, no is difficult problem. for everybody. For me, it's yes. difficult. <laughs> yeah. Don't worry. Yes, but, but the class, it's okay, everything. Good, good. And I, ha I have sent some um, videos in the group uh, that are related with vocabulary, grammar, music. Are you checking them? No, 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 teacher. For example, today I sent a, a, a video about a a listening test for kids, okay. for kids. And it, it's very easy. Uh, if you have time, especially in the in the weekend, for example, Saturday or, or Sunday, if you have time, I, I imagine you go to the church too, but, but in a specific moment, if you have time, you can check this, uh, you can check these videos. Let me show you, I'm here, right? Okay. This is the video for today. It says listening test for kids. Okay. Yeah, yesterday I sent this video. Look. What's your address? Okay. Yes. This grammar, grammar. And on Monday, I sent another uh, video here. Vocabulary. Okay. In some set. So every day I send a video. So if you have time, please, uh, you can check it. Or maybe in the lunch time, maybe you just open it. It's just 10 minutes, five minutes only, right? Okay. It's extra material. And oh, another recommendation, uh, Carlos, is that if you have time during the, the weekend, you can you can see a movie in English. Do you have okay. Netflix? Yes. Do you have Netflix? Yes, yes. Nice. Perfect. So you can put the option of, of English and try to check uh, cartoons, movies for children. Because okay. it's basic and, 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 and you can understand. And also you can put the subtitles, but in English, not in Spanish, in English. Ah, uh, okay. Yes. My recommendation. We, we try to see it. Uh, in English, a, a series, a movie, oh, nice. uh, the, the, the subtitles is in Spanish. No, 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 please, no, Spanish, but, no, zero percent Spanish. <laughs> okay. Now. now on, the King of Atlanta, right now on, you, you're going to check the movie, but subtitles only in English, please, right? Okay. Please. Right. And also the music, music, oh, come on, I learned with music, uh, believe me. But you know, I am old school. <laughs> I'm 70s and 80s, so yeah. No, but but me, me, me too. Uh, oh. I listen to music in English and I play video games and in English. The, the most video games uh, is in English. Ah, okay. Nice. So that's my recommendation, yes. And and that's it, right? Also on Fridays, I am sending some audiobooks. They are very long, like three hours. But okay, you can practice. For example, last time I sent the video of Oliverio Twist. Oliverio Twist is a poor guy that lives in London in nineteen in the eighties. No, it's not in the eighties. In the nineteen eighties, in in los mil ochocientos. Okay. So let me see. Por aquí está el libro de Oliverio Twist. Or give me a second. I will. I want to show you. I lost it. Ya lo perdí. Okay, but it's a book. Uh, this is because uh, Carlos is an, another the audio book. book. It's an audio book. Yes. You, okay. just put, you can put your headsets, and you can, or, or, or maybe you can listen. Right. Uh, in the house, you can. Uh, clean your house, wash the dishes, right? And, yes. and listen and, and listen the book. Okay. Okay. So that's my recommendation. So 
audiobooks, uh, music, movies, extra practice. Extra practice. Okay. Of course, you can you have to complete the platform. I can complete yes, the platform yes, yes. También, you know. And I will do now the pending out task. The only difficult you're going to have is in the in the exercise four, right? La tarea cuatro le va a costar un poquito porque hay una palabra que se llama leadership. And leadership. Leadership. Mm -hmm. En lugar de decir honesty, uh, responsibility, que son uh, los values, the values, uh, there is one that is not uh, leader, leader T, no, it's leadership. S-H-I-P. S-H-I-P, leadership, right? What, what does Leader. it mean? Eh, liderazgo. Ah, leadership. ok, ok. Liderazgo. Leader. Ah, leadership. Leadership. Okay. I will show you, if you want. Le voy a mostrar. Ok. Uh, todas las tareas, all the tasks, are just to one option, you know. Task number two, options. Task number three, options. But task number four, you have to copy. Ooh, bueno, ahí. Ah, ok. Sorry, okay. <laughs> ya le dio la respuesta de la uno. <laughs> so you're going I don't to... see, I don't see. <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. No, okay, excuse me, yeah. And you can check in the manual, the page numbers. Page number uh, 12. Here in the manual, right? Okay. Remember the manual is... In the platform, está en la plataforma el manual. And I, en inglés corporativo, send you the, 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 the PDF uh, file. Te envió al grupo el, el, el archivo de PDF, si lo quiere bajar, right? So, okay. the manual. Ahí está el manual. You can, even if you want to print it, do it, right? So, that's it. Okay. Five tasks. One, two, three, four, five. In six today. And six today, yes. If you don't have time, you can make it tomorrow. But try okay. to make it very fast, right? Uh, Carlos, right. it was a pleasure for me to have this little session, right? Thank you, know, thank if, you. Do you have any extra question? No, no, any question. Any suggestion for the class? No. No, no. no the so class is, is good. The okay. class is good. Okay, it's a pleasure, Carlos. Have a good night, and I see you. Have a good night, too. Bye-bye. Thank you. Bye-bye. You're welcome.